Yeah, so, hey, welcome. It is morning time for me, so this is not usually a time slot that I stream in. But probably one that I should experiment with a bit more, I don't know. Ugh. It's just, dude, getting up early for me is always just... It's a struggle. But, uh, yeah, thanks for uh, tuning in. I got an energy drink, so it'll perk me right up. I'm already where I need to be, so we're good. Just a sec. Do you get anything for donating to the bird? I just want to say. been Nate if you got something for being nice to the bird. I remember the first time I bought from here. I accidentally stole. Because it doesn't take your money right away. And I felt bad. Because the bird's kind of polite and then you steal. Anyway. It has been a while since we took a walk in the forest, yes. And how our world has changed. Say, do you know about the far side of this deep gorge? Some say there is an ancient temple deep in the woods. The ancestors of the Hylians created the temple. Signs of their civilization, ancient, but very sophisticated are everywhere. If someone could obtain the power of those ancient people, well, I am sure it would go a long way towards saving Hyrule. Lunk, would you take on this task? Would you cross the gorge and find... The ancient power sleeping in the temple. Uh-huh. <laughs> I knew you would. To cross the gorge, just use my partner here. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Do you doubt my partner's skills? He flies like a dream, believe me. You'll definitely make it across the gorge. Wait and see, my doubting friend. I forgot about the golden chicken. Okay. <laughs> I kind of just... I quite literally winged it. <laughs> I'm glad that worked out. Because it was an accident. Right. Okay. Come here. I'm hoping to get through the majority of this today. I don't know. See, I was going to play Diablo 4, but, uh... As to be expected, it's a dumpster fire in terms of server issues. So, you know. Oh, well, I'm not surprised at that. Oh, wait, I already have this one.
It's okay. I've already played it before. <laughs> I, I was fortunate enough to be allowed to play it early last year. So I'm not that fast, but I know some people that are very angry right now. The lesson is, don't, don't go out of your way to play a game. I mean, in the sense of, like, taking a day off work or taking, putting something aside, you know, that you're meant to do. Just don't do it, particularly if the game is online. Like, honestly, when, what was the last game that launched that, uh had its online play be smooth on day one. Let alone a beta. So. You know, I never looked around here if there was a heart piece. I should probably do that. this time. I also have to pay attention to the sound because I think I'm missing a bug from this area. Oh, there's no minimap here. Do you know what one of the advantages of being in Australia is? I mean, when it comes to this sort of stuff. For once, I mean. Whenever there's these sort of launches, um, the Americans kind of get stuck with the shitty end of the deal. They deal with all the server issues, and then they go to bed, and then suddenly the servers are fine. And that's pretty much the prime time for Australia, so it's like, work's finished up. And then you go play a game and it's fine. Like, all the issues are gone. And then when they wake up, the issues are back. It's just... That's probably what's going to happen here. I'll play Zelda for most of the day. I'll have dinner and then, hey, servers will probably be fine. Done it, but I guess not. Hmm. hmm. I'm 
so it's just easier to ignore these things. Wait, what? The Did one of the entrances close here? Sandy, what's up? Where? Oh, no, it's up there. Oh, okay. They can levitate, that's... that's fair. Mead, now you want to help? Is there a spot I can... They don't... They don't go away long enough. They're back after like 15 seconds. Okay, the only other thing I can do is maybe hit it. Arrow or something. That's a Poe, that's not the thing. Okay, hang on. Yeah, unfortunately this area doesn't have a mini-map, so I can't really see how many there are here. Just go away. Okay, there's the light. That's a lot to be giving. about to summon them again.
gotta look to see where the light source went. I was about to say I'm not being chased anymore. I heard the sound. They're up high. gonna hit it right away. No, I'm not waiting. <laughs> that was fun. I'll tell you what. I'll let you into a secret place. I have no memory of this, uh, this palace, temple, whatever. <laughs> like, I'm not really- I, I don't even remember what boss or item you get here. You know what? This might be where we get the statue control thing. It would make sense. The sacred ancient forest, so this is what they were talking about. Okay. It would make sense, the statues are here. I hear a bug. Unless it's talking about this one here. Probably already have this one. Yeah, so I need to find the other one. Oh, it's a little bit of a nuisance. <laughs> okay, where's the other one? Faster gas. 
Wait a minute. Did I never see this? No, I did. It's just I didn't, I didn't have it at the time. Stop. What is what am I what am I seeing here? See, this is one of those things where I, I question why we couldn't have done this the first time we were here. I guess maybe we didn't have the knowledge yet. Ow. Music stopped. Because things got serious. Mm. 
have been like a massive nerd. Nerd out. <laughs> it's like, oh shit. It's the temple of time. I mean, I didn't, I didn't play Ocarina properly at, when I played this at this point, so... Probably didn't have as big of an impact. Looks cool though. Thing. Doesn't make a gong sound. Flunk. Do so you think there's something odd about that statue? In the grove and in the temple entry, there were always matching ones on each side, but there's only one here. Why don't you use your senses to look around? There was originally one here. We need to find the other statue. The statue business is like a replacement for the cane, which I think is, is better. I always found the cane that spawned just a solid block to be really weird. Hey, not so fast. At last, this is it. This is where I've been trying to get to. The ancient technology of our people sleeps in this place. We've searched all over, and now we're so close. I can smell it. Once we find that thing, we can go home at last. So gracious, yes. Uh, young man, we're so close, so please help us find what we're looking for. So creepy. Almost walk past them. <laughs> Just, I don't know, it didn't click, they were torches.
I think this is at the end, just to transport the statue. Oh yeah, and then... Okay, I do remember this. It's just the map, right? There's no way that's... Yeah. <laughs> it's too early. <laughs> I kind of wish they only reserved the big, you know... Oh, something's good in this chest. They reserve that for just the item. Anything else is just... Oh, yeah, you know. I always used to be disappointed when that animation would play, and then it would be, like, the compass or the map. You'd be like, ah, oh, that's just this thing. Especially the compass. I was never excited for the compass. Uh, yep. That is quite the infestation. resorting to too many arrows. Just culling off the close ones. That's probably enough.
I just didn't want to run out of arrows, so I went for splash damage instead. <laughs> Even then, it did, uh, it did not work out as well as I'd hoped. Then, why did I go to the effort? Hang on. There has to be like a crush pad down here somewhere. Why would I have gotten this out? That's, uh... <laughs> Does it reset, or is it just stuck there now? You had to do it. I mean, how else would I get it? I got an answer to my question. So, 
like, I'm guessing I was supposed to take out the spiders. In a totally different way. Oh, this is like, that's it, once it's done, it's done. But I, I opted to do this the convoluted way, okay. intended effect. Doesn't go any further. <laughs> Be careful not to destroy stuff as well too quickly. If it, if it is any any consolation, I feel like I'm more than halfway through that alphabet, and there's only so many more stamps that can be. Okay, I guess that's it for this room. was that? I thought I shot that well. I 
against that on the... Yeah. Compass. If you think about how the compass works, I mean what it does. It doesn't make sense, because a compass- all a compass really does in reality... It just shows you bearings. But this compass just <laughs> reveals items. I don't know. I feel like a metal detector would make more sense than a compass. was that? Analog stick just decided, okay, that's the direction you're facing. side to this though. I mean I think when we come back I'll be able to get it. I need to guide stuff through it anyway. item does have its uses. For enemies that swarm. Scales of balance, right.
Forget how you got that one down. It might just be wind. Alright. line of them behind me. a stamp. This should work. There's only four. What is going on? Ah, this, these aren't on properly. <laughs> there we go. Ronald Weasley. No idea who that is. Oh, Harry Potter. Yeah, I don't know anything about Harry Potter. Yeah, it's like... You'll know about Harry Potter if you're into it. But I don't fucking know. Never read the books, never had an interest in it, so... Harry Potter isn't as universal as you think. 
I know of Harry Potter, but I don't know specifics of it. It's kind of like people that get shocked that not everyone's played Zelda. It happens. I didn't watch the first movie at least. Nope. It just didn't seem... It just wasn't my thing. Now, Lord of the Rings, I did, I did watch, but... I got into that. Harry Potter just, I don't know. Just didn't appeal. It's not a commentary on, like, the quality of the series at all. It's just, for me personally, didn't, didn't pique my interest. Not in the slightest. You know, it probably didn't help. At the time when those movies were coming out, I was working in Kmart, and for anyone that's worked retail, or at least, I don't know if that's still the case now, but usually they have this, um, this promotional video running on on the TV. Right. And it it loops the same ads. It's like usually half an hour and then it just loops. I do remember on one of them it was for a Harry like a Harry Potter I think two Harry Potter things were on it. One was a movie and the other one was a game. And so, when you work, like, an eight-hour shift, and pretty much every 15 minutes, you're hearing the same voice clip from the movie, you don't really want to see that movie afterwards. Because at that point, it's just like a... It starts as an earworm, then it becomes a brainworm. So that might also be the reason why. But granted, even when the books were... When the movies weren't a thing, and people were reading the books, it just didn't appeal to me. It's just not my tastes. Like Jack Ryan. I don't see many Jack Ryan commercials. Right now, the thing that when I go watch other people's streams, like when I have a time, I keep getting commercials for that stupid Dungeons and Dragons movie. And I'm not saying the movie's stupid. It's just at this point, like, it's stupid in the context of I've seen it too many times. And I'm not going to see that movie out of spite because of that. So. Anyway. Just not my thing. What's that? References that not everyone understands? Let's go through the list of, like, popular shit, or at least things in pop culture that people think are universal, but aren't, that I don't know of. Five Nights at Freddy. Don't know shit about that. Constantly get referenced and memes about it. Don't know. Undertale. Don't know anything about it. Haven't played it. But I would like to play it, it's just I feel like at this point... If I play it, it'll probably be off stream, because I've, I've heard things about backseating when it comes to playing that game for the first time. <coughs> the only ad you get is for Panadol, but you rarely get ads for some reason. Huh. Interesting. Also, hey, is it Twitch yet? Isn't that late for you? Super late? Am I correct? No, not quite. I'm just never streaming at this hour, so like time zones are weird for me. Uh, midnight? Yeah, okay, that's not that late. I've heard people get weird ads. Um, let's see, chicken wings. 
I was really happy. Um, Monolith got an ad. Who got an ad for? Hang on, someone got an ad for Condom Swans. I'm pretty sure it was Monolith. Unfortunately, there was no screenshot of it. Yeah, this one is it's teaching it's basically making you use everything that you've learned so far. This is the only time you'll use the combat techniques taught really, and it's like a requirement. Dark Knight cosplay when I'm not talented enough to make a decent card display. In more ways than one. It's like... I wouldn't be able to make the outfit, but the other thing is like... If I was to go down the path of, say, a budget cosplay... I wouldn't be creative enough, either. <laughs> you know... You gotta be good to do a cosplay. But, you know, um, what else? Minecraft, that's another one. <laughs> one of my cousins asked if I play Minecraft, and I said no. And just the look of disbelief, and just... It's like, what, you play games, don't you? Like, you don't play Minecraft? I'm like, nah, man, it's like not... It's not that... It's not as universal as you think. One day you'll force me to stream Minecraft. I've played Minecraft, that's the thing. My opinion is not someone that hasn't played Minecraft. I've played it before. My story of playing Minecraft is... I used to do the... I used to have, like, uh... The regulars voting on what I would play next at one point in time. And at one point, I was like, alright, let's sit, let, let's put up Minecraft. And a lot of people were like, yeah, play Minecraft, yeah, play Minecraft. I played Minecraft, no one fucking watched. <laughs> even, even worse, like, I was like, oh, I don't really like this. And I gave it a try. I did, it's just I prefer Terraria. It's more... It's more what I like. So, you know, I just silently stopped playing it and no one noticed. So, uh, my opinion on Minecraft, it's not from someone that hasn't played it. I, I did play it. And I just... The entire time... I was like, nah. I want to play Terraria instead. But those are my personal tastes. That's it. It's got nothing to do on how good the game is. I understand the appeal of Minecraft and why it's popular and why people enjoy it, so... It's just not for me. Please don't take issue with it. <laughs> just... I did try, at least. Like I said, it's not as universal as you would think. Flip? What do you mean, make him do a flip? Don't take an issue, but one day I will stream it and have you join. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> I don't mean to be negative, but like... It 
here's the thing. I'm very, very... I wouldn't... I don't want to say OCD, because OCD is a real thing. And people struggle with it, so I don't want to belittle that. Or make it seem trivial, like someone that genuinely struggles with it. So let me put it this way. I'm very particular when it comes to doing streams, especially when they involve multiple people. Right? I personally don't like doing something where one week it'll be the ideal scenario and then it falls apart the next week. And that's what happens when you play with a lot of people. It's kind of like... And it's just because of life in general, right? And time zones is the other thing that comes into play. But, like, you know, the first week everyone will be there. And then pretty much the next week when you try to arrange it again, someone will be like, oh, I can't make it. Or, And it's just a thing where someone's always going to be missing. And then you kind of postpone it. And it ultimately ends unfinished. And more often than not, one person's chasing everyone else up to, like play the game so when it comes to playing with random viewers i just don't do it for that reason because i can't bring myself to do it it's just in my mind i know how it's ultimately gonna go that's why when it comes to playing games with people i'll play games with people that i know i can rely on to be able to do it on a regular basis but also not have to chase them down So, yeah, that's why you're probably not going to see that. Especially not for Minecraft. Like, I, I just... I wouldn't do it. It's not to say, it's not to say never. I'm just saying it's like really, really unlikely. I'll do it for $200. I wouldn't. Because that puts a value on my time and I don't believe in doing that. Because then it's like, okay, so he can be bought with $200. What else will he do for $200? And at that point, I may as well attach a car battery to my nipples and just stream that. Like, let's just go to the extreme right away. Besides, this isn't, like, a job for me either, so... I reserve the right to be like, nah, I'm good. I'm not saying never. I'm just saying that it's very, very unlikely. That's all. I think the, on the only context I would see myself doing that in would be, like, if I am, to some degree, like, a large enough streamer where it's like, okay, there are, like, uh, I'm not putting a literal number here, because it's not this number, just to be clear, but, like, you know, hypothetically, a hundred people asking me to do it, and then I'm like, alright, a bunch of people are asking me to do it, fine. Once, but nah. Even then, I'd still probably say the same thing. I'd be like, listen. I just always believe in consistency. And I don't want to do something that's like a once off. I've already got my Christmas tradition. My Christmas tradition is playing a game from childhood.
I feel like I'm only saying that because I don't want to go back on what I said earlier. What am I going back on, specifically? I'm not going back on anything. Like, I've always been like this. For me to do anything multiplayer in the context of streaming, I want it to be good. Define good. Well, my definition of good is one, it sounds like I'm having a good time because there's nothing worse than when a streamer is playing something and you can see they're not having a good time, but then they still keep going. But the other thing is good in the context of quality from my perspective. Like, I want to be happy with the quality of the stream. And part of that quality is, you know, being consistent with the people that are involved in the playthrough. Like, I don't, I don't want it to be something where it's, okay, one week it's like everyone's there, and then the next time we do it it's just always like someone's missing, or I have to chase someone up, or we have to wait on someone, and then it eventually gets to the point where it, we just don't finish it because of that. I've had that happen too many times with other stuff. Like, early on. But, yeah, I just... I want to be personally happy with what I'm doing. So, I need it to be, like, of a certain quality. I don't know how else to put it. You can't finish Minecraft. No, I know it's open-ended, but there, there is like a... For better, for better or worse. There is like some semblance of progression in that game. So at a certain point you can kind of say, okay, I've done the majority of what the game intends. Like, we can keep going, but we won't. But I guess what I'm saying is like... It's... It's still consistency at the end of the day. It's just... I don't want it to be a thing where it's like, you know, one week it's fine and then the next week it's not. Because that just... I just don't feel motivated to do it anymore when it's like that. Just asking for a one-time deal. Yeah, but like, I wouldn't... But that's what I'm saying, like a one-time deal, I probably... you. What would you do in, in one time? That's what I'm saying, like that game... There's so much to do in it, like I know the extent at which you, you do things in that game, like... A one-time deal just doesn't work for Minecraft. If I was to be like even two hours into it, you're not gonna get much done in it. And it wouldn't, it, like, I guess there's always, there's already the precedent where I didn't personally enjoy it either. <laughs> like. <laughs> I got, I got the previous experience of, you know, people voted for it last time. I did a few streams of it, no one watched, so it's 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 kind of left a sour taste in my mouth. Not that that was the only metric, but also just compared to Terraria. Uh, yeah. I enjoyed Terraria more. It's 
so it would make me adverse to trying it again. It's like, okay, yeah. I did the I, I did more than the one time deal. Uh what am I meant to be doing here? I think this is just it has to be perfectly balanced. Maybe I had it right. Hang on, get it off. Yep, there we go. And then I need to invert it. I don't want to sound like I'm complaining. I guess I'm just giving my, my reasoning as to why I don't want to do it. Just being transparent. I don't want to say no and but not give a reason. I appreciate that people want me to do things or play ga certain games, but also have to look at it from the grand scheme of things as like demand and also my own personal enjoyment of it. So I have taken that into account when it comes into when it comes to Minecraft. Tried it once, didn't work. Not not really interested in trying it again at least not with uh not with how things currently stand you find it fun to make a streamer play a game yeah i, I don't because it goes one of two ways it's either the streamer will enjoy themselves and it's all right or the streamer will visibly not have a good time, and then it's not alright. I just don't believe in doing things that I won't enjoy. I guess like doing things where one person will be happy but not me. <laughs> Was there another heart piece in this dungeon? Hang on. I should probably check the chests. Um There is another one on this floor. That's the last chest on this floor, so if there's anything, it'll be there. Uh, the bell's over here. I think all I have to do is just shoot now. Wait, but am I trapping myself here? If I do that, I might be. Hang on. Yeah, I am. I should not... side.
And I think this is where we came out of, that's why. Okay. This place was meant for veteran players? I don't know. I think this... I was gonna say this felt like one of the easier dungeons to me. I mean, in the context of getting to the end. Doesn't look like it's meant for a kid. Huh. I don't know. I was a teenager when, when I beat it, so... I don't think any of my brothers had problems beating it either, and they were kids when this came out. Switch. is also very muted, it just makes you think. It is thinking music. Sounds like the K music and Pokemon. Which one? Okay. I'm getting more vibes of like an underground Mario theme. you can hit yourself with this. It's kind of funny. Probably haven't heard of the game, Tales of the World. Uh, no. I didn't have a PSP. They did... I remember they didn't do well here. Man, that was just like such squandered potential, the PlayStation portable consoles. I think the problem each time was just they kept insisting on doing their proprietary media. 
the OMD and then eventually that memory card that they came up with that was proprietary instead of using a normal memory card. They charged the premium for that memory card. A pretty insane amount. It's a shame because the Vita was a nice looking console. That OLED screen. Oh. I got I had one. I used to play the binding of Isaac on it on train rides to work. Somewhere. Do I need to do the switch thing again? Probably. <laughs> it's not what I wanted to do. curious about something. I'll look it up in a minute. Another switch somewhere. What am I missing here? That's where it came out of. I just what if I'm just complicating it oh <laughs> just yeah don't try to be smart just break shit go caveman mode <coughs> don't worry about finesse just caveman chat hang on <laughs> there is a chest that I've missed I don't wanna I don't wanna leave anything I don't want to have the potential of missing out. Is this the floor? Yes. 
I'm correct. It's, it's this room up here. There's something I didn't do here. Good work. Oh, you know what else I didn't do? I didn't bring up the other one with me. I mean, I went in here, but I assume the reason I didn't get whatever it was was... I just didn't have the control thing, and now I do. I did see a, I did see a little statue to the side. Multiple little suckers. So I did need this. <laughs> Please be a heart piece and not a stab. <laughs> I'm gonna be sad if this is a stamp. Okay, good. Worth. Alright, now there's peace of mind. All the chests have been acquired. Don't have to stress about this. Pretty much at the end, yeah. people fall for this. Just not realizing. <laughs> Just smash the game. Hang on. Can I 
I wanna. Okay, well, it did. Right. It's just through this door. I can't remember if there's another chamber. Oh no, it's fine. We are at the end. The boss key is so redundant then at this point. It's like the statue may as well be the boss key. You know? Like you just have this room here and then it's another door. Legolas! Damn it. I missed. There we go. I've never been good at sniping. Any game that's an FPS, just not good at sniping. This is going. I'm looking up something. Uh, 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 let's see. Spinning. 
top strategy. Fade blades. Come on, I should be allowed to do that. <laughs> that there's no reason why that shouldn't have worked. Other than no no, not allowed. One hit at a time. The fight must be must be something the player experiences a challenge with. Can't have it in too early. I looked it up. I spent 22 hours in Minecraft. <laughs> so I did give it a fair shot. I thought this was over. Guys, are just white. Oh no, there's, there's a proximity thing on it. Of the mirror shards are ours. Just one left. Yes, now we go to Sky, which I guess that's what double hook shot is. Lunk. You saw how nasty that monster was, right? The evil within the shards is more powerful than you can imagine. You know, we could be assembling something truly terrible here. It could be something we'll ultimately have to destroy. We have to hurry, let's find the last shard, Lunk. We have to reach the sky, that's where the last shard is supposed to be. Yes, save, please. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do a small intermission since it was one dungeon. 
but I wanna get a refill on my caffeine. Has I did get up early and it's still morning. So, uh, if you're watching this live, hey, two minute intermission. Get a snack or something. If you're watching this on YouTube, this is where this part's gonna end. The previous parts have been like four hours long each, so I'm keeping this one a little bit shorter. But enough to do a dungeon. But yeah. Uh, chat, give me two to five. YouTube, see you later. Bye. <laughs>